When you're doing a back stitch, what's going to end up happening is you're going to start off with just taking one stitch, and then you're going to have like a space, and then your your uh, thread will be coming out. You can you can push it through and pull it all the way to the other side. Again, making sure that everything is nice and loose and just laying on top of there, and then come forward just a little bit and pu pull it through too. But the other way you can do this is if I come in here, right where my stitch was, if I go back, and then I just come a little bit forward, right there, see how there's that, the stitch is right there, I went in right there, and I came out right there, and then I can just pull forward, and again make this very, very, just laying down on top of the fabric and not pulling too tight. I can do all of that with the same, with just one stitch and never having to like poke through from the bottom side. You can do that whole stitch just right there and then pull through. Okay, sometimes you're gonna get a little bit of a knot like this. What you wanna do is you wanna take the loopies and pull it with your needle and make sure, there's another one in there too, you see it, this one right here. You want to pull this out. Basically, it just kind of got twisted up on itself and made a slip knot. So if I'm very gentle with this, I can pull it all the way through. But if you pull on that loop first, it works out better. So that's how we do that. 